Welcome back to another video guys. Today is a super exciting one because we are staying in one of the uniquest accommodations in the Philippines. We are staying on, on a houseboat! <laughs> Jump in! So this place is located here in Koron and we are literally in the middle of a lagoon. So beautiful, yeah, I no. love it. This place is called Paulin House but you can literally find this on booking.com, Airbnb, everywhere or you can literally contact them on Instagram. WhatsApp as well I think. We'll leave the link in the description mm. anyway if you do want to contact. So we got picked up by the port by a speedboat, which is organised by Paulin, yeah. and it was literally very quick. It was so it, beautiful as well. It like is beautiful. The view. It took us about 15 minutes to get here, and when we arrived there, we were welcomed by loads of amazing staff, and we literally had coconuts, fresh coconut. coconuts. Yeah, we were given fresh coconuts literally right there. Um, the view was amazing. Imagine drinking a coconut, and then you look at the limestones with the clearest water in the world like the water is literally sparkling because where the sun hits it it's just incredible mm. we had lunch there as well we basically just got like three sets of starters mm. each so three for us three for my parents and it was really delicious too and this place is completely off-grid guys it's completely powered by solar panels and we're completely in nature like i'm so excited to be spending the next 24 hours here i love what, it what an experience <laughs> but first, let's show you around. Let's do a quick room tour. Okay, let's show you around. First of all, we've got our sun lounging area with my parents perfectly modern. <laughs> <laughs> they, they can't keep their faces together. It's all right. Come with me. We have got an amazing dining area. So we'll be sat here having our breakfast, dinner, with a great view of the bay. Is this a bay or a lagoon? Lagoon. With a great view of the lagoon. And then we've got an outside shower. We then come through in here and we've got the first bed, which is amazing because it literally looks out into the sea. Like this actually, wait. So in the morning, you'll have this view. Morning dip, sorted when we wake up in the morning. Back to the room tour. We've got fans. Mosquito repellent. A walkie talkie. Mm, we'll try and use that later. Hello, Pot. <laughs> Hello, Pot Ate. Goya. They can actually hear you. No, they can't. I'm not pressing <laughs> the button. We've got a phone. There's actually Wi Fi here, which I wasn't expecting. Another fan. And then we've got another double bed here. And then three singles. You can fit seven people in here, guys. Seven people. Come through here, and we've got a shower, and it's hot too. And then my favourite bit is the toilet because it's so small, it looks like a kid's toilet. Look at that. It's tiny. And in order to uh, flush it, you like... You do it manually. It. Yeah, it's a manual flush, it's pretty cool. And then there's mirrors everywhere, which we keep kind of like nearly uh, walking, walking into, into ourselves. And then there's two sinks. And then we've also got kayaks, paddle boards and life vest, snorkels, everything included. We can even go to like Twin Lagoon and stuff because it's just a 15, 10 minute boat away from here. So can't wait. So there is actually aircon if you want it guys, it's up here, but you do have to pay an additional 2000 or 2500 for 12 hours use of that. So if that's what you want, but I think we're gonna try with the fans first and see how that goes because we should have a breeze coming in most of the night, so awesome. Let's jump in! Look at the colour guys of the water, it's just insane. The sun has gone behind the rocks now so it's not as bright and doesn't look so twinkly and, and as blue. Or more turquoise don't you think? Or emerald? It's less turquoise slash emerald colour than when the sun is directly on it. 
but it's still so beautiful. And we have decided we're going to go on a little snorkel adventure. adventure in the kayak. So from here, you can get to Twin Lagoon, you small can get lagoon. to Small Lagoon, and a coral garden. So, uh, and it's all like the kayaks are included and everything. So we're going all to go on a little to, adventure. All you need to pay is just the entrance fee. So I'm not sure if there's an entrance fee at the snorkeling bit or if it's only at the Twin Lagoon. But they get, provide a map so you can find out where it is. Everything's like 10, 15 minutes, mm. not far at all. So let's get going. Let's go. Let's lang oi. Woo! Gonna see Nemo, let's go. So you have to wear life jackets, it's mandatory uh, whilst you're on the kayaks. But look how close we are to the limestone rocks and they just look amazing. They're so jaggedy, so sharp. And look at this one in front of us. Looks amazing, guys. This is such a cool experience to just be able to go to one of the main sites just by kayak, just 10 minute kayak, and we'll have it all to ourselves because by this time, all the tour groups have had to leave. So it's kind of like exclusive access to some of the main locations as well. So highly, highly recommend because that all comes in with staying at the houseboats. Alright guys, so we have made it at the snorkeling spot and it's beautiful. It's literally just outside our lagoon. And it was about 10 minutes. Yeah. 10 minutes were very good. <laughs> a few moments later. Alright guys, to order a drink or food, you get this little walkie-talkie that you can order. So I think press that one. Radio check. Just say hello, Bob. Hello, Bob. Hello, Ate. Hello, Ate. Can you order a drink, Bob? I'm going to pass the ring to the FNC department. Okay, Bob. Okay, Bob. Hello, ma'am. Sir, good afternoon. How can I help you, ma'am? Hello, Ate. Can I order one liter of juice? Yung, ano, yung orange juice? Ano po yung available na 1 liter juice nyo po? Um, it's coffee, sir. Yes po. Tsaka isang bucket ng ice po. Ag at extra cups po. Dalawa. It's a job well done. That was good, isn't it? And then they'll deliver the food or the drinks that you order via a little banka or a little kayak. Not sure. Or a speedboat actually. Because we came here on a speedboat. It's easy like that. Delivery. Grab here what? Pauline grab. Grab boat. Grab delivery. Yeah, grab boat. Grab banka. It's not a banka. Grab paddle. Grab delivery. Good afternoon. Cheers to the houseboat. Cheers. 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 So we've been treated with quite a nice sunset guys. We've got lots of pinks coming through now and the water is so peaceful, so calm. And there's this really nice bird that keeps uh, flying around. What's it called, dad? I think it's a kingfisher. A kingfisher? I've never ever seen a bird like this before. It's like bright orange, it's beak as well, and the body and then bright blue wings. And it looks incredible. Uh, but I don't think my lens is good enough for you guys to see it, but I'll try and get a picture and put it on the screen here. So yeah, so far this place has been great and we're just waiting for our food to be delivered in about an hour and a half's time and we're just going to relax and enjoy this houseboat whilst we can. One hour later. Alright, so our food is here and they actually deliver it on a tiny little boat. So I'm quite surprised it doesn't tip or anything. But yeah, let's go and eat and then we'll show you what we've got.
Hey guys. We're going? Yeah. First impression, this is your first time okay. playing to Ron. This is my favourite guys. Thank you. Oh, you're brave, you waiting for me. Okay, yes. Mm, that's delicious. Very nice. Mm. Can you see why it's my favourite? Very mm. nice. It's very good, isn't it? Mm. Give it a go. It makes it more like a marshmallow, isn't it? Sort of crispy on the outside and soft. It's a good middle. one. They're adding jackfruit to it. Oh, jackfruit too. Mm. Like I said, guys, this is my absolute favourite, and I always find that the ones in Corona are always extra tasty. So let's give this a go. So we're now on our second course of our dessert and my favourite. All right, so the food was nice, especially the fish and- oh, it's the best fish ever. The mango float, oh my God. Yeah, dessert was top notch, 10 out of 10, massive wrap. Mm. But anyway, we're gonna sleep now and we'll probably see you in the morning and we'll let you know how we slept, if it's comfy, comfy or, or wavy. <laughs> if <laughs> yeah. there's a storm, we'll let you know tomorrow. <laughs> but yeah, we've been stargazing as well. The stars here are pretty nice. Mm. That's a lot, but anyway, good night. Night. The next day. Good morning from the houseboat. Oh my god, last night was hot. <laughs> I said it's pretty good though. Mm. I think the main thing is you feel really hot at the beginning, but then once you actually just lay still, you're fine. Mm. But the bed was super comfy. Mm. It was actually. And imagine just waking up to this view right in front of you. Oh. But I think Zar wants us to head over to Twin Lagoon in the kayaks before any of the tour groups get there. So it's currently seven o'clock. Uh, breakfast is at half eight. So do you think we can be back in an hour and a half? That is the question. That is the question. Mm -hmm. So yeah, let's give it a go. So I think we're nearly there. We're not sure which one's which, but look at the view. Oh my God. Beautiful. Look at the rock formation and the limestones. Ah. Okay, guys, I'm trying to get in, but I don't want to get my hair wet. Uh, I don't think that's the wet. Oh, oh. Back to the camera, no more. Can't now. I saved you, I'm a lifeguard. It goes off. Yeah. Oh, I didn't want to get my hair wet. <laughs> minutes later. All right, so we got back just in time for our boat delivery of our breakfast. It's a houseboat grab. <laughs> I got crepes with Nutella, which is like the first time I've had Nutella since I left England, so I'm super excited for that. What did you get, Zah? I got the continental breakfast, but with extra rice and hot dog. So, yeah, get in there. <laughs> Thank you, Pa. Mine's here, yours is here. Mm. Mm. 
And look at the view, guys. It's just insane. Wow. Breakfast with a view. Breakfast was so nice. We've just been swimming around right here. It's honestly, it's just unlimited crystal clear water. And it really is just so nice to just be constantly looking at such beautiful nature and water. And we're just surrounded by limestone, basically. Yeah, and we've been seeing all these like really pretty birds that we've never seen before. And then just having the, the typical Caron what you expect to see in Caron, just right in view of wherever we are on the houseboat is just insane. So it really is paradise here. We highly, highly recommend. I'll put the link in the description and there's more than one houseboat as well. So there's all different types. Yeah, so there's different a glass one size. as well, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. All for different group sizes, different, like you said, uh, types mm. of houseboat. And it looks like they're building more as well. So watch out. So the check-in here is normally around 2 o'clock, but I think they want to pick you up ar around 12 o'clock so that you can um, chill around the restaurant bit because you can actually swim there, get some lunch and just have a few drinks before you check in. The checkout is at 12 p.m. It's currently half 10 and they pick you up and then they drop you off to your hotel. So price-wise, it's actually quite good because everything's included, transport, pickup, and this, this whole place is just amazing. Our time here has been amazing. We're just about to get picked up now by a speedboat. I'm sad it's coming to an end. Yes. I wish I could stay here for longer. It's honestly amazing. It's a must do here in Caron. What do you think, guys? Oh, Super. Absolutely wonderful. See, you heard it here first. And the food is amazing as well. Yeah. And the staff is wonderful. So friendly. They're like, they go above and beyond to make sure you have a really good stay. So we're going to get in the speedboat now and we're going to head back to the mainland of Caron. And we've got more adventures to come, so. All right, so we're gonna end the video here. So make sure to like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below, press that notification bell on. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace. Bye. Magnificent. <laughs> right, guys, so we're getting dirty ice cream. It's Zoe's parents' first time playing dirty ice cream, actually. Delicious. Ubi and cheese, that is. Is it? Mm. Yeah. So the purple one's Ubi. Lovely. Lovely. And I'm boiling, so. <laughs>